Hey, what's going on, everybody? Welcome to the show. Thank you, Drive Shaft Drew, for coming in. I got his sticker right here, and I'm supporting OnePugLife.com. Look, I don't know where Tom Noble is. I sent him. I, I sent him the message. I I hope he comes. Um, that would be awesome. If he doesn't, I understand if there's a problem some way somehow. Um, Roadside Dan, I'll work on the wrench thing. I tried, but I just couldn't find you. So uh, I apologize for that, Roadside Dan. Thank you for coming, Dave Collins. You're awesome. And welcome to You Dizzy Live on YouTube. Uh, I got a, my, a guest here. My son is here to visit, so he's going to be on the side, which uh, is a wicked positive thing. I'm all psyched up inside. Wally Wheels is here. I want to thank you so much. Oh, look, there's Tom Noble right there. Hey, look, Took a little bit. We're wearing, we, we must think they're alike. We're wearing the same shirt. Yeah. Freaking right. Thank you very much for coming, my friend. I had to turn the volume down on the other computer. Well, like I said, thank you so much for coming, my friend. I always enjoy seeing you. Not a problem. Happy to be here. And uh, I want to say, you're doing a great job on the car. I was watching your video, your last video yesterday. And, man, I watched you cut that piece out and then put all those little welding, all those little pieces to make it just perfect. And, you know, that's just going to come out so awesome. I can't wait to see it all done. <laughs> For real. Yeah. The problem is, is I screwed up on that right panel big time. So we're fixing that now. Yeah, but we live and learn, you know, it's like we learn through our mistakes and I do the same thing, you know, I just don't show that in my videos. <laughs> <laughs> I, I show everything, I'm not proud. I know, that's what I'm saying, we're getting to see it, so, you know, I, I bow down to you, you, you know, not, you're not afraid to show the mistakes and that's where we all learn from, we're saying, oh, he did that, and oh, he had to, okay, it, you know, so we learn from that, and, uh, you know, I appreciate you sharing all of that, you know, the pluses and the minuses. Yeah. yeah. So, so uh, uh, I did, I'm not sure you got it, but I did uh, send you a little uh, PayPal uh, for the shirt. I, I don't know if you checked or whatever I have you. And I live in Worcester, Mass. I got it. All right. Just I got, I got it. Sure. <laughs> Oh, I haven't even paid attention to the chat. Let me apologize. Uh, Michael Horsford is in the house. Uh, Channel 33 with Spongy. Wally Wheels, thanks you guys so much for coming. David Collins, again, I want to thank you. Wizard's in the house. I hope his internet is working out, man. I heard he has problems. And if he wants to be on next week, if he's got everything situated, Wizard, you can be on next week, okay, sir? Wayne, Wayne's in the house. Tim Caldwell's in the house. Flash TV's in the house. How you doing, brother? I hope you're feeling good. Tom, can you PM a message with a a, a price for a XX Lodge shirt with with shipping? Well, the it, the shirts are really simple. Uh, small to extra large are seventeen fifty. Double X is 1850 and any size bigger than that is 1950 and it's $7 for shipping. So just send the guy 20 bucks so he'll, he'll be all set. <laughs> it's the guy captain's in the house. How you doing, brother? We're live with you, Busy, and Tom Noble. Who would have a thought? Freak on, right? And look, we match today. We're wearing the same shirt. They claim it's fixed. Wizard says they claim it's fixed. I'm praying for you, brother. We were talking about you on uh, Robert Nerdin's show, and we, 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 he told me that it, it was just dick. You have better luck with your internet, my friend. Mr. Mark Rums in the house. How are you doing? You all right? <laughs> my son's here watching me. He, uh, he came to visit today unexpectedly, and I'm freaking psyched. He actually came with gifts, but I'm not going to touch him until after because I'm already excited enough. They came with cards. Oh, did they? You're going to rub it in. You're going to rub it in. 
Drive Shaft too. Here's a link from Tom Noble's channel. Everyone go see him. That's right. Go sub Tom Noble. He's got a great channel. He's doing great work. He's a member of the YouTube Garage Gang, and I'm proud to know him for sure. For sure. The Redneck Railroad's in the house. What's going on? I've seen your work. Uh, he's Jason. This guy, the Redneck Railroad, he's building this huge railroad set, like a whole setup, and oh man, it's coming out beautiful. Yeah, but he says he learned a lesson. He said, draw out what you want to do first, because if you just stop building stuff, you're going to build it and break it down and build it and make it. So to save yourself some trouble. I've built Have you? Yeah, see, I knew you'd be interested. I've gone to, I've bought like different trees. See, Land my here. son drinks this in that too. A bad echo? I apologize for that. I shouldn't be. Mr. Mike One says you're the boss. I made you dizzy a sign in the Wally Wheels on the hook sign. Freaking right, right? I'm a, I'm a boss. A boss of what? Someone's playing the stream in the background. No, I'm doing it just here and that's it. Tom, uh, it says, I think Tom needs to mute his YouTube stream. I did. Yeah, sometimes it does that all on its own. Yeah, I got I got the the other computer muted and even I got even got the sound turned off. I turned off the sound card. Yeah, yeah, see, I, I don't have nothing. I don't have nothing on my phone. Hey, I'm good. Hi, I'm Brian. Welcome to the You Dizzy's live show. Thank you for coming. I appreciate it. Freaking right. He says, not yet. Steve is at Steve. Steve is at the house. The chat's moving so quick, I can't keep up. A little echo from Dizzy. I apologize. So you're echoing? I, I don't know. That's what he calls. Oh. I turn my speaker, my volume down. I hope that works. We got. Don't forget to everybody to smash that thumbs up and share this video on every one of my videos and Tom's because we're good guys and we deserve it. I mean, I don't have that patron page like everybody else asking for funds, but if you watch my videos and share them, that always helps out and the same with everybody else. Right, Tom? Yep. Yep. The more the, more the merrier. Beg your pardon. Steve Robb's in the house. Freaking right. He did a good video on the shirts. Uh, and uh, I think uh, the picture on the back is very awesome. I think the way you did it, look, it came out really nice. And, and I'm going to be proud to wear that shirt as well. You mean this, this? Oh, absolutely. Yes. I got a guy. I make it. I got a guy lining up to make a sticker off that back. Oh, awesome. Oh, awesome. So we can we'll get, get one of those too. See, we you know we're about supporting, getting the word out there, the YouTube Garage Gang, and just being a part of something bigger than ourselves. You know. Yeah, I'll find, I'll know more on Monday, so I'll put it in the video on Monday on the stickers. Awesome, awesome, and you know we uh we got a great crowd to share the word. You know, Steve and uh, HO Motorsports, Anthony, he's uh. He's a great guy, and he's been helping out. Flash TV, too, he's a great guy. I'll be right back. My phone is making me run out in the rain. <laughs> I might help to just turn the barn down, Dizzy. I, I tried to turn the barn down, Dave, but sometimes I, it's like that. And I even, before I started the show, I shut my whole laptop off and started again so it wouldn't do that, but... It's still doing it. Huh? Look at Mr. Mach 1, what he just said. Mr. Mach 1. He said, so $27 for a fat boy shirt? <laughs> <laughs> I forgot. <how> it... <laughs> 
I sub to you, David. Oh, oh you sub to David? David's got a good channel, too. And he's been watching some of my videos, so I appreciate that. And Dave, I, I got a, a hell of a playlist. I just went to a, I don't know if you've seen it, Tom, but I just went to um, two different firehouses in one day, which is, you know, it sounds like nothing, but it's a lot of work to load that bike and unload it and load it and unload it and load it. You know, it's a pain in the neck. But um, I like doing it, and we had a blast, and uh, I guess the town... Uh, took some photographs and stuff, and I'm going to put it in their town paper. And they actually invited me to the parade, and they're having a medieval, a medieval 4th of July celebration. I don't know if you guys can really see that, but um, they invited me to it, which is pretty cool. And I'm going to be in the parade. they got fireworks and a carnival, and it's supposed to be really cool. So I'll have some videos of that. Someone running a video on the stream other than in a house church? No, nobody's no. No, it's me and my son and no one's running nothing. Tina's phone's right here. My phone's right here. I've been watching for years. Musty One put me on TV. Oh, Musty One's awesome. I gave Musty One a 1948 Cushman scooter and uh that someday he'll be clear. Chopper's Rules is in the house. He's going to want to share it, right, Chopper's Rules? Over there across the pond to spread the word. Those ones are $47.95. <laughs> yeah, I want to thank Steve Robb for posting a video on the shirt, too. Absolutely. You can ride your fire truck bike in the parade. Yes, I got special permission to ride it in the parade. I've actually been sneaking that fire bike and my John Deere bike into parades for five years now. <laughs> Proudly. <laughs> and this year, you know, it's kind of special because I've never been invited. And then this year they gave me a an application and I actually am being allowed to be in the parade, which is totally awesome. That's cool. Yeah, Tim, I think these are the town fireworks. They won't let you light them. It's probably all um, official people, I guess. I don't know. I've never been there before, but I hear it's a big four-day extravaganza, Saturday, Sunday, Monday, and Tuesday. So, Pug has the movie bike all pugged out while we all said, yes, one Pug Life, i like to show you the, uh, his shirt, and, and this is one of his shirts. He just put a sidecar on that stunt bike that I sent out to him, and somebody's going to break a femur, I swear. <laughs> <laughs> not me. I'm not. I just they built the bike, and they're destroying it and, and building it back. So i got to give them credit for that. They're doing a great job. I'm proud of them. And I thank you for doing that. Yeah, the sidecar. I can show you a picture of it, I think. I got a, a quick picture here. Someone's PMing me. I can't even message them. I just can't while I'm on the show, okay? Whatever it may be. Oh, the sidecar. Here we go. Sneak peek of the U Dizzy bike with the sidecar. Oh, yeah, he did. Oh, did. That's really nice. Someone may get hurt with that. I'm not sure. <laughs> yes, the can show was is going to be really nice. Use my email for these That's right. That's right. Thank you, Tom, for putting that in there so people can see it. See what he did? Oh, he put it his name in the chat so they can click on it. You see, these are the people writing. I just got it on two different computers. <laughs> Need a cigarette or something? Want to drink it? Are you gonna coffee? Checking on my son. Tickle, 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 Tim. 
Rusty's in the house. Rusty, I want to give him a belated uh, uh, birthday wish. So his birthday was yesterday, I believe. So happy birthday uh, the day late, Rusty. And H.O. Motorsports said he was going to be watching in his car or something and he wanted to call in, but don't call me. I don't answer the phone, man, on the show. Wally, you can build a flight car for you. Let's look at how easy that was. Everyone's still asleep in chocolate house. Well, if you tickled them, if you tickle, tickle, tickle them, <laughs> they'd get up. So how are things going with you on this Saturday, Tom? Uh, I was just in the catalogs looking at interior stuff for the car. Haven't been out to the garage today because I knew I was going to be on with you. So once we're done here, I'll go out and spend the rest of my afternoon in the garage. Now, I got a question. I seen that that's fiberglass, right, that you made like that? It's a fiberglass rosin that I paint over the fleece once I cover the put the fleece on the on the, the wire frame per se then you then you get it tight and then you mix up some fiberglass rosin and you put that over the fleece and then once you put it on the front and the back side and then it just becomes a, like a fiberglass panel I think that's really cool and what I gotta do is I'm, I'm building this trike and I gotta come up with some sort of have you ever seen a police bike where they got that fiberglass back where it's like a trunk or a I, I gotta figure something, and that looked cool. And it looked like if I just built some sort of frame like your building, um, I could do something like that over it. And where I seen you're using that fleece, I think I could use like maybe uh, a police thing one of, of like maybe uh, um, I, I don't know a flag or, or something like that or. You know what I mean, and try something like that. Are you gonna see that, like when the car's finished and you got it posted? Are you gonna still see that? No, no. It's I haven't decided whether I'm gonna upholster those or just leave them uh, satin or paint them satin black. But uh, when you put the rosin on the fleece, it's like the fleece I got was for the Cars movie, and when you put the when you put the rosin on it, it sort of distorts the view. It fogs it up so it doesn't look really good. Right. right. Well, that's stuff. But you can always paint. I mean, whatever you do, what you can do on fiberglass is, I mean, that's what it comes out to be, Dave. Now, you can always now, paint. So, so when I looked at like that finished product on the outside, is it like smooth? So if I painted it, it would be smooth, or is it like the texture of what you use? It's it's roughly got the the it's it's almost like a, a I want to say maybe a hundred and twenty grit sandpaper, the the texture on the outside because of the fleece, right? And so so you have to sand that down. You can use body filler on it. You can do just about anything with it and form it in any shape. And it works great. I mean, it's, this is the, I was taught this thing, God, about 30 years ago, and this is the second time I've ever done it. It's like I'm watching and it seems cool, like that small metal thing. I'm looking for something that, like, I can put on, and if there's a problem, I can unclip it and pick the whole, you know, the whole fender thing off. Because it's got a live axle and a big sprocket, and if there's something wrong in there, I want to be able to pick it right off and move, you know, remove it too. That's what's kind of taking me so long as I think about it too much. I sit there and I'm like, well, if I did it this way, oh, no, that ain't good. Well, if I did it, no, that ain't good. It's been two years I'm staring at this thing. I think if you, I think if you go to some of the salvage yards and everything else and look for a metal case that you can fix or cut and adapt to it i think you'd be better off on that rather than going the fiberglass route yeah maybe maybe i or i was also thinking what, what about the old style airplane route where it's just pieces of metal you know to fit in and just rivet them together that look you know yeah yeah that would be a neat look right i think that would be cool too um, I want to say hi to James, he's in, and he's in the house, Dale and Crystal, hi, how are you? 
they're saying hi to you. It's just Crystal right now, and Gail is out mowing our new zero turn. Oh, he's getting spoiled with the zero turn. Well, Amber, I'll tell your husband I'm doing okay. I'm still kicking. Geez, I want to thank everybody for smashing that thumbs up. You guys are awesome. 23 watching and 24 thumbs up. Can't beat that. Nope. Steampunk style. Everybody see my new haircut? Did you see that? Jay, you see my haircut? Tina gave it to me. The mate. It was free of charge. <laughs> Right here, but I'm gonna right? Yeah. Judge, right? Yeah. Yeah. Some of the skull. Right. Yeah, but look, we have to be here. Go live. Fucking right. Hey, Dizzy. Saying hi from the road up by Flash TV's neck of the woods. Shop play. play. What's going on? He's up the road from the from. Uh, Class TV. Where is the maid hiding? She, I, I, I don't know. She went down to open the door for my son and disappeared. That was from Drive Shaft Jew. Drive Shaft Jew has got a great channel. Everybody go subscribe to him. His stickers right there. And the stickers like up there. And if you want to send you Dizzy a sticker, I'd be happy to have it for sure. And put it up on my boards. Not you, Tom. I got yours up there. Yours is way up there. And I couldn't see it right there. And I see it. <laughs> I try to show off everybody that sends me a sticker. You know, I got I got them on my truck when I drive around. I got them in my toolbox downstairs and stuff. And now I got them up here. You know, spread the word of everybody's channel. Where is Tina? I, I would call her, but her phone's right here, so it wouldn't do me no good. Call Aaron. Call Aaron. We can just check where they are right at this moment. On live, on, on live show. To check where they are. On the live show, we're going to make a phone call, which I never ever do in my whole life. That's right, Crystal. He probably did that right. again. She's not going to answer. Probably the best out of me when I'm live on me or YouTube. Message sent, Tom. Okay. Cool. See. Stacy Reeves is in the house. What's going on? Thanks for coming and hanging out. We were talking about. Uh, Tom's new shirt, and I got a few things going on. I wrote some stuff down. I got the fire bike is uh, in, gonna be in a parade for the 4th of July, which is awesome. And so what I've done is I uh, ripped the gas tank off of it because it had a couple chips in it from over the last couple parades. So I sanded it all down, primed it up, and uh, repainted it a couple coats. And I actually took off the tape off the stickers and everything today and it, it, it looks beautiful so i'll be putting that back on and it's all ready for the parade i tightened up all the wires and the wire harnesses and cleaned up everything so that's what i'm gonna do i want to uh tell everybody to go check out uh channel 33 with spongy he just did a huge trip across canada and he's got some videos coming up of a, a nice you know, stops along the way and some scenery that he's seen along the way, which is really cool. And go check out my new friend, Dave Collins, who uh, was in the chat. And if he pops up again and says something, you guys can go check out his channel. Um, it's always good to add new people to our crew, you know. Flash PM to the tracking number. 
How much in UK for the T-shirt? I, I don't know. Seventy-nine nine a pound. Not sure how that translates. Chat's awful slow today. What do you guys want to say? You dizzy can keep up to the chat. For something I'm else. back. To, I'm back. Diz, the front doorbell rang. Wizard wants to know how much to UK from t for a T-shirt. That one's going to be nine ninety-five. I tell you. <laughs> Let me go to the post office website and we'll find out. Well, that's awesome, Chopper's rule. He's going on a memorial, memorial bike ride today. <laughs> 79 and a half five. <laughs> No, Wally Wheels. His his car show is not today. I think his car show is June twenty sixth or June June twenty third. This is just the May two four or, or something. It's uh the Memorial Day in, up there in Canada. Roger O'Connor's in the house. What's up? Roger, look, Tom's here. Came on, hang on. <laughs> Flashes, what's he doing? He's tile in his bathroom. Flash be good. Make sure you mix the grout properly and seal it. It's thirty two ninety five to ship to the UK for a flat rate envelope. There you go. And there's your dinner. <laughs> I want I want you to kind of uh, talk about uh, what you you know what you want to talk about because today i'm probably going to keep the show to an hour only because my son came to visit and you know that doesn't happen really often so um i'm going to probably end the show at 5 30 or something so if there's anything important you want to say or you got coming up or don't just feel free to say it okay okay well i still have some of the old style gray shirts for sale and uh, I got a whole bunch of double X and and about four XLs. So I had people order those and then back out and didn't uh, didn't didn't buy them then. So I got a whole bunch of those left over. Okay. Okay. So those are still there. Plus the regular shirt. I was thinking though, Diz, on your shirt here. Yes. Should we say? Should we put mass hole there? If you'd like, that's fine with me. <laughs> Instead of worse sure. <laughs> well, I was just kicking that around. Absolutely. The baby. Sorry, Dad. The baby. The baby. The baby. Sorry. I had to feed the baby at birth. Oh, yeah. oh, she stopped at the yeah. baby downstairs. No, Nicole came outside. Everybody was asking where you were and Hello. how come I had to creep up on the chat all by myself with Tom. It was hard for us guys. Kelly. So give me a price for UK you? You extra large one shirt and shipping. Yeah, I'm typing it up now, Diz. Okay. Enjoy your time with your son. Oh, Those moments don't happen much anymore. That's right. That's right. And he uh he's very special. <laughs> yeah, yeah. Babies are that big. Okay, shut up. You want to show your face on YouTube? I don't know. Face come over here next to Tina for one minute. Well, come on, you no, mean come my side? Right, just, just one or two. That's it. 
I'm not. I'm not famous on YouTube. Or not. Yeah, shut up. No. You're not famous. This is that's not me. Look at this is Aaron, everybody. How you doing? We got two ladies on the show today. This is Aaron. You're surrounded. My son. You're surrounded, wife. Diz. Say that again. I, I said you're surrounded. He's surrounded. So uh, now you're live on YouTube. Mm -hmm. These are the people right in here. Pet monsters in the house. There's Tina. See, I missed you, Tina. Oh, so Tina is the type of the yeah, how Well, you that's see how I keep up with it because <laughs> I yeah. Did you see Chase? Ed? Yeah. Oh, I didn't call you the other day. Awful. I just said hello. I forgive you for everything. You, you know, you guys are awesome. Oh, I think we'll be for everything. You got your ears loaded, honey. You're looking handsome. I did. Look, Tina did it. I love it. Look at it. She she lined lines. you up so good. She lined you up. She lined you up. <laughs> My toe like. is killing me. I don't know why. I'm busy. You're so surrounded. I'm just going to go pee, honey. Ladies. Honey, get in there. Show me his head. Tell him. So you just caught all don't. the death bites. You know what I mean? You do what you want. Don't feel pressed. Hi, Amber. Hello, everybody. Was that you, David, that was calling the phone? Yeah. Oh, okay. Because I was saying, where are you? Yeah, Those I know. We were on the porch talking to the baby. <laughs> we were on our way up and the porch came down there with the baby. Yeah, oh, yeah. Between the babies, and you know her. She wants some boxes. Hey, what's going on, WK? Plum Bob's in the house. What's going on, Plum Bob? Chopper's rules. Smart minds. Hey. hey, Tina. Mm -hmm. Happy as you. She's always happy. And look, she's wearing, uh, uh, um, don't tell me, the Bobcat Guy shirt today. See, we're just all about the shirts, right, Tom? You know, I yep. got the Garage Gang shirt. We got another subscribers, other subscribers. We, he's got one on with. It's all about he sharing. That's what you do. It's a hot coach, but it's hard to tell. My son coach, wears yeah. my shirts. What is, what's yeah, that link? What's going on today? Oh, oh, awesome. oh, I got you. Hey, Diz. Yes. Is Dry Chef, is Dry Chef Drew just running commercials for the T-shirts? Uh, I just see it over uh, and over again. Uh, Drive Shaft Drew is my dad, and uh, he's in charge. He he does it. He's does an amazing job keeping up on the chats, telling everybody the thumbs up, helping out with the links, and, and I mean, uh, all I can do is bow down to him. He always helps out no matter what. You know? Oh, Drew! Amber oh, thanks, Drew. Amber Rivers said that link is given an error. Yeah, so you have to do that again, Dad. Try to fix that. And, and what's good is my son's here. Dry <laughs> Chef Drew. I'm gonna slow this in there. Well, he is. Back. Drew is on the line. He is. He, is. he, he tries I'm to be right on. Grant, Grant, what are you been up to? <laughs> my friend Grant Hubbard's been taking tests like crazy. He wants to. Uh, it goes that way. He wants to become a. I think it's a an RN, but for health stuff, he'd have to tell you. But he's doing a great job. My, Michael, uh, my friend Michael Horsford's got a nice garden going on. He's got tomatoes growing, all kind of stuff. Oh, was it eighty-eight on here? You can PayPal it to him. You can send him a check. You can uh, send him a money order. His email account, right? Email account, right? A natural path. Okay, natural don't laugh theory. at me. Naturopathic doctor. Oh, See, now you know why you did. He couldn't say it. <laughs> 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 Michael wants him to yeah. heal him. He does. He looks great. One day you do. You look, you look I don't oh, know. I'm getting, I'm getting my energy back. Yeah. Gee, he is. He's got over a dozen. My oh, son's yeah. a hero. You don't even understand. 
So he's been on a long fight. I don't think that's the. Uh oh. You hey, know, he said he got it. Oh, okay. I wasn't having breath. I think I sent it to me that PayPal account. Hey, did, you, did you do a bit on your fire bike tank tray? I, Rich, I did a, a video on everything. If you go into my playlist and into the fire bike videos I th or, or bikes and things or one of those ones that has the whole build when I started it till I finished and then I take it to every firehouse I possibly can and take pictures, let them ride it if they want. I put it in any parade I can possibly put it in. If I stay um, same bike ramp. And I just try to be loud and obnoxious with it. All right, Grant, you be good. I think right. I just we, can, we can take five hand out. It's a pretty cool pass. Oh, yeah, yeah. Let me pull him out. I'll pull him out. Pull him out. Pull him out. Yeah. My son came with gifts. Hey, go the last okay, time he came, he came here, he came here with packages of these, and they were all full with like model, model A's and model T's and stuff. This time, um, we'll see. There you go. Oh, look at this. This is all I got one right here. I'm going to break I'm going to cut my other fingers off. Oh, I cut my other fingers off live on YouTube. I'll be a, a laughing star. I'll be a laughing star because YouTube wants Everybody watching us? Oh my goodness. Your knife is squeaky. No, it's the phone. I'm sorry. I know. Oh, look at this. Look at that. That's cool. That's one. Oh my goodness. I just want to know I'm going to cut these. I'll share this tape. I think it's better than that one. Why didn't you guys tell me that? Should have been writing in the chat. Hey, Dizzy, Dale's here. Hey, Dale, what's going on? Is she slave laboring you out there? Oh, my goodness. Look at this one. Oh, just look onto it. Very nice. <laughs> oh, and the door's open and stuff. Oh, my goodness. You know I'm never going to take these out of here. I'm going to have to put them in the thing. Over there. The maid has disappeared from the show today. She, she's disappeared. Oh, wow. Look at this one. This one is like mine. This is just what I got. The pickup. I got a 1928 pickup like that. And Jay, you want to hear something funny? A third of it is up here in my bedroom. Yeah. I carried it up here because I was running out of room in the basement. Tom Neebel needs subs, guys. Hook them up. <laughs> Drew, you're awesome. <laughs> cool car. Oh, wow. Look at this one. Look at that. Look at that. Very nice. Okay. He said they, they all have the cards to describe them and everything. Yeah, it, man, right? oh, yep. Yep, the card, all the cards to them are right here. That's cool. Even the mailman. mailman. <laughs> Look, he even sent the mailman. <laughs> 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 you know, you did you love the mailman. I got one more. I got one more. Look, we're filling the show with those bikes. Hey, Diz. 
You can yeah. use that truck then. You can use that truck when you you got mail video. That's right. That's right. That's right. That's right. I'll use that in my videos. You got me. Oh wow! Look at that one. That's one of my favorites. Look at that. And the door opens and everything. Oh my goodness! Every That's time cool. my son comes here, he brings me cars. Like. I'm going to tell you, almost his whole life, I have, and, and how old are you now? You're 30 now, right? I used to be a lot bigger than that. Yeah, like I got a whole set of die-cast cars, Mustangs. You've seen the, the 1969 uh, Mach 1, but you just always stop. I, know, I love you, Joe. You're awesome. I don't know why you think of me so much. I actually collect that in the Actually, He's into that, the Dragon Ball Z. Yeah. Action figures, Dragon Ball Z, and things like that, which is pretty cool. I subbed you both back. Thanks. Oh, so, uh, Flash TV subbed us. Thank you, sir. Thank you, sir. Freaking awesome, Mark Horner. Thank you, Mr. Mark Horner. Would you just look at Would you just look at that? The ten, ten of them. Yeah. 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 I think I so. Little, little ones like that. I'm going to have to move the big ones off the rack and put all those little ones down the bottom. Um. Big Killer's in the house. What's going on, Big Killer? He was looking at the cars and said, cool, we're live. See the sign that says live. Do you got a yellow flashing light outside your front door saying you're live? You know, like no. you do in the TV studios? I do have one, but I, I, I don't have it hooked up to turn on and flash yet. <laughs> but I did get one. Cool. I think I think it was Harvey Spooner who sent it. I'm into chicken. Oh, he's into chicken balls. <laughs> wouldn't that be Wouldn't that be rooster, not chicken? <laughs> yeah. Right. Yeah, so I mean, I'm all excited and geared up for the parade. You know, I'm just proud that uh, I actually, you know, force myself into so many different things that now people actually want me there, you know? And that's how you just make a statement, right? <laughs> there you go. Get your foot in the door. Right? You want me here. You don't even know it yet, but you do. <laughs> <laughs> Yeah. yeah, I mean, I, I can't believe I've got away with it. And, and you know, I, I think my kids enjoy me, you know, doing it. And my my nieces and nephews stand on the parade route and yell and scream. So that just makes me feel cool, you know. So I enjoy it. And I'll do it as long as I can, I guess. Thank you, Wayne. It says, I enjoyed the firehouse, but the bike in the box looks great. Thank you. Thank you. It was a lot of work, my friend, and I made it like a lot of eye candy. So when you're looking at it, there's so many things to look at. You, you just kind of go, ah. <laughs> um, Chopper's Rules Fireworks is good. Um, women always sell. I, I mean, anything like that. Everyone loves you, Dizzy. He's freaking awesome. Mr. Mach 1, thank you, sir. Tom, Tom Mobile is a superstar. <laughs> I see Drew's at it again. Yeah. <laughs> Gotta love Drew. David Cohen says, my brother might be signing on. Well, what's your brother's name? What would that be? Would 
My name's David too. I'm you dizzy, but I'm a David too. You are not my man. I'm glad I came across to you on YouTube. Well, who's that? Me? Oh, Brian. Hey, is it Brian J that you came across or Tom Noble? They, they also said that they're glad that they came across that channel. Well, thank you. Are you, doing, are you doing that? How would you know? You disappeared from the show. All my all my subscribers are all upset. They're scarred emotionally on the inside. Too. You can keep that one up there. And you missed all the... I heard Tina call you, Dave. Yes. It's Dave, David... <laughs> Brian's here. Did you see him? Brian's here. Did you see him? Brian, did you see him? He's here. Brian's here. <laughs> How many? Is that someone calling you? Calling you? No. Oh, that girl is definitely going to get a beating. Remind me, uh, Jason, to whack Sheena in the Thank forehead. Thank you, Spongy. Uh, uh, yeah. Sheena's trying to call me on the Google Hangouts when I'm in the middle of the live show. <laughs> Dizzy, how many fire halls visited now? Oh, wow. No. I, I don't know. No, that's one thing I don't have. Good afternoon. How you doing, buddy? How you doing, buddy? Okay. Can I have speakerphone? Yes, you are. Okay, good. I'm going to pull over now so I can talk to everybody. How's everybody doing? This is uh, HO Motorsports on the phone with us, if you guys yeah. can hear it. Farron will be hey, quiet. Hey, Anthony. I'm sorry. So, um... I just wanted to call him because I know you got Tom Noble there, and I'm sure you guys, I haven't watched the show today, but I'm sure you guys are talking about the t-shirts, the club, and everything that's going on, right? Yep, correct. And I just wanted to let everybody know, let's just say it out loud, um, I want to thank Tom for stepping forward and making these shirts for everybody. Um, that takes a lot. And I've gotten a lot of uh, questions on my channel on how to join, and basically it's still the same simple stuff, I just want everybody to know, all you have to do is be a good guy, and you're in. That's right, that's how I got in, just being a good guy, and I appreciate it, and I met a lot of awesome people, and I want to thank Tom also for uh, stepping up and doing what he did, I appreciate it for sure, I wear the shirt a lot, just as you see today, we didn't call each other, and we're both wearing the shirt today. And uh, I'm just uh, happy to be a part of it. Uh, it's my pleasure. I enjoy doing it. Uh, what you call it? Lord Ice Cream Water. You guys might know him as Mike. He's got the 50 Plymouth. He's got the Nova Falcon. Yes. Uh, I'm going to meet my buddy Steve. He was the one that helped up Ruben. Helped Ruben with the rackets and all the stuff. Uh, you know, and a couple other guys that you guys don't know. And, you know, we're going to hang out. I got my shirt on. And uh, like I said, I'm proud to be part of it. Um, I don't really care what it was based on or why it started. I just believe in the concept of helping people. And if anybody um, has seen my Facebook, I posted a picture of the new shirt from Tom. Okay? Uh, I listed me and VW Rich, as everybody knows. And I wrote on there, the statement I wrote is, if you're one click away or one video away, from knowledge and that's how I feel that's correct and, and like I didn't know anything when I came into this and any question I've had has been answered to me free of charge free of harassment free of any you know why do you need to know or, or my way is better than any it's just straight up advice and, and uh, good advice and I'm just you know, glad to have friends like you guys. Yeah. I mean, you got to think of it this way. The whole generation, our kids, right, 
are going on Google and they're Googling this information, and we're the ones supplying the information. So we have all the knowledge that we've accumulated over the years, and now it's time for us to share it, and we're sharing it through video. Absolutely. You know, even, if, even if it's what we're doing isn't exactly something we're comfortable doing, we are still sharing knowledge and pulling knowledge from other people out there for people to learn from. That's our job. That's right. That's right. I believe that too. As you see in my videos, I do it like I'm doing it a little bit different, but I'm still doing the same thing. I'm building mini bikes and giving them away to kids that normally wouldn't have it so they can get those motor skills, start playing with the bike, playing with the motor, get into the whole garage steam. And you, you never know. One of these kids, they might be the next best mechanic, you, you know, just because they got a free mini bike years before, you know, and that's my hope. Yeah, but put that aside, forget about the free mini bike. They just got something from somebody and they might do that again in the future. Exactly. And that's what it's all supposed to be about. Exactly, exactly. Bye, Big Killer. Bye, Big Killer. Bye, Big Killer. Um, I'm only going to be on another minute that I have to run. I do want to say that I have Mike and Steve, minimum, probably a couple other guys that I want to do a live show. And these are people that have lots of knowledge. Some of them are 10, 20 years older than I am. And I want questions to come to these guys on stuff that they're, not that that's the high tech, but something like all, something that's not getting passed on that they might need the information from. And that's the type of live show I want to do, at least once. I just want everybody to know that. And that's what I'm trying to set up. I'm going to talk tonight about it when I go there. Yeah. I'm sure that, you know, that's going to sell. A lot of people are going to want to use that information, and I'm sure a lot of people are going to tune in and ask questions. Because, you know, I I don't get, you know, no more enjoyment out of talking to an old mechanic. or Like, I just went to go visit the fire station, and as we were going there, there were these two old, old men, and I don't mean it by, you know, not, I don't know them, and I just looked at them and I, there were two old men sitting in a garage with a Model A sitting right outside. And I wanted so bad to stop and just ask them questions about, you know, anything about their car or about just some of their knowledge, no matter what it was, you know, just because that I, I'm so interested in that kind of stuff, you know, but I didn't have time. I was on a mission, but I do love that. I mean, to me, the easiest way to make a friend or to start a conversation is if they're with a the car that I'm interested in. I just walk up to them and just ask them some basic questions. And you can tell right away if you guys are going to hit it off. And if you do, you just might have made a lifelong friend. That's right. That's right. I mean, that's how I met all the guys from the Los Angeles Car Club. That club was formed after we all became friends. That, that, I didn't get into that we were, the, we were the formers of it and it's basically the same thing as the YouTube broad gang we're laid back people there's nobody running it you know what I mean you just have to be a human that's all that's all that's required yeah and I'd just like to say one last thing I think you were the one that said it said the best that it goes back to a year ago when our t-shirt thing was happening and I think the comment you had passed was it's like when you're driving down the road and the people that are in the club, the people that are opening up their garage stores to you. And if people leave the club, that means the garage stores closed. That's right. And the way I yeah. said it was almost exactly like that, Anthony. I said YouTube for me is like driving down that road um, going to anywhere, like Route 66, and you see the house after house after house, you know, and you're like, What's in there? What's in there? And you never know. You're just driving by house after house. Well, YouTube is you driving down that same road and getting to look in each and every one of those garages, see what they're building, what they're into, what they're collecting, what just what they're about. And, the, you know, you can learn so much just from, you know, that alone, just talking to someone what they've been through or, you know, the experiences they've been through. Yeah, and it doesn't always have to be to the guys that don't 
they put on a fence on and like floating or taking it part of it. It doesn't have to be automotive. It could be you building a fence. It doesn't matter. It's just, it's just you being part of something and sharing your knowledge. That's all it's about. Absolutely. Well, I want to thank you so much for taking the time to uh, pull over and chat with us, Anthony. And his channel, if you want to go check it out, is HO Motorsports on the YouTube, and he rocks as well. Hope you don't, guys. Well, thanks for having me, and I'll talk to you all later. Have uh, a good night. Oh, you too. Okay, bye. Bye. Anthony. bye. Well, that was pretty cool. Helga's in the house. Hi, Helga. Sorry, I haven't been paying much attention to the chat, but thank you guys so much for keeping it on. And I don't know so many people into scooters, Dave asked, but um, there are, just punch it into YouTube. There's a lot of people into it. I'll go on to Facebook. There's scooter um, clubs on Facebook. I do belong to a lot of mini bike uh, clubs but not so much scooters. Muscle Palooza next week at Lebanon Valley Raceway. Muscle Palooza. Oh, wow. John Amber with his homestead. Homestead Tessie's in the house. I'm not going to stay too long. I I'm actually going to leave this show in another two minutes. So, Tom, you want to chat something up real quick? Your shirts? Yeah, let's do this shirt one more time. Uh, the 2017 shirt is done, and that's the front. This is the back. Love it. And uh, if you want one, just email me. It's at tanoble at cox.net, and we'll get together, and I'll get you a shirt. Uh, they are seventeen fifty for small to extra large. Double X is eighteen fifty, and three X on up is nineteen fifty. And there you go. And I still have some gray ones like this still available in double X and extra large. Awesome. Awesome. Uh, John's in the house, uh, Amber's husband. Hey, how's it going? Um, I, I want to thank you guys all for coming today. It's been awesome. I, uh, I have to cut the show a little short. My son uh, is here to visit, and uh, family time is, uh, you know, is the best time. So I'm definitely going to spend it with them. I want to thank everybody for coming to the show. Wizard, you're going to have to get with me about next week. Tom. My friend, thank you so much for coming, and I'm going to make another video during the week and mention the shirt for you uh, again, so we'll try to get it out as much as possible, and you know, when I receive mine, I'll do it again, and you know, we'll, we'll do the best we can, and, and the stickers sound like a great idea also. And, yeah, I'll, I'll, I'll uh, make a video on Monday on the stickers, so you'll, as soon as I hear from my sticker guy, we'll, we'll know on those. Awesome. So they'll probably, awesome. they'll probably be about this big, this. Oh, so, cool. Oh, cool. Yeah, I think he said he can get four to, an, four to a sheet. So I think they'll be about this big. So. Oh, that's pretty, oh, that's pretty good. good. So I want to thank Dave for coming to the show, John, Wally Wheels, Helga's Pennsylvania Cooking, Mr. Mark Long, um, my dad, of course, uh, Drive Shaft Drew, Kim Codwell, uh, Chopper's Rules, Amber, I want to thank you. I want to thank uh, Channel 33 with Spongy for coming and hanging out with us. Um, you guys are just awesome. You, you come all the time, and I appreciate it so much. Um, just tune in for some more videos. I got videos on doing some work on the fire bike. I got, oh, matter of fact, I haven't mentioned this, but there was a fire right up the street the other night. And I went and covered that live. Are you busy on the scene of a fire again? So I'm, I'm on those fires also. Um, Wally, thank you so much for being a great guy. You're always hanging in there and being cool. And, and just, I love it when you come and hang out over here. You were peeing on me about the show. Thank you, Wizard. You, you, you're awesome. Dale and Chris will can't forget us. Dale and Crystal, I can't forget you guys. You're awesome. 
<laughs> Yeti Katani he came in at the last minute. So he gets a shout out at the last minute. You see that? And Roadside Dan, he was the first one here always. I, don't, he's, I think he's stalking me in the bushes. Roadside Dan. Freaking right. So thank you so much for coming to the You Busy Show. I'll see you guys all next week. Peace out. You want to say bye? Bye. Have a bye, night, Amber. Bye. Bye, Tom. Thanks, Tom. We'll see ya.